All right, fighthype.com, Sean Zatel. Uh, what a privilege to be joined by one of the greatest fighters, one of the greatest champions in all of boxing's history, former undisputed middleweight champion, former three-time light heavyweight champion, Bernard the Executioner Hopkins. Bernard, we got a big fight coming up. Luke Campbell uh, taking on your fighter, Ryan Garcia. I know you wouldn't be talking to us if you didn't believe in Ryan Garcia. Uh, what's special about this kid, and what do you see playing out Saturday night? What's special about Ryan Garcia is uh, his poise, his, you know, his salesmanship, but also what backs that up is his talent. And I think when you analyze um, in the last, i say, two to three years, he's grown really fast as far as experience, as far as um, poise and, and executing, whether it's the left hook or the right hand, one punch knockout, and he's not, to me, a big puncher, um, but he seems to be the right puncher and or in the right way to throw the punch, seem to be getting these guys out of here. Um, and when he take on Campbell, Luke, that is, you got to understand, man, you know, Luke don't get walked over. You know, Campbell don't just get steamrolled. And Ryan has a great opportunity to do something that most people haven't done. And I have not only uh, confidence come January 2nd, but I believe that he's going to be tested like never before. And he's going to have to overcome that. And when he do overcome that, we're going to be talking again soon for a possible super fight. And you must take care. He must take care of January 2nd. And uh, I've seen him spar. I've seen him his press conferences online. I also understand his mindset by being around him, by having conversations with him. He's ready, man. He's ready to take that that next spot of superstardom. And 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 you've been around boxing enough to know certain or every generation, whether it's ten years, twenty years, but let's say ten years. There's that special fighter that comes along. It's not three of them. It's not four of them. It's not. And it's not like these guys is not compatible they most generations had most compatible guys underneath that superstar that super talent that super talent and this ain't all hype look at his record look 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 the last three or four fights he fought you need to go deeper than that but i'm just gonna say three or four and then look on look at his demeanor they wanted to fight and wants to fight everybody in that division, especially if you got a belt. He's calling out top guys. He know that he can compete with these guys and he has to show us, the world, the fans, that he's ready for it by winning and becoming great well, in time with himself. He's not great yet, but he has he has a road to go through, to, to, to go through to be great. And the road is laid out. Start January 2nd, all the way up to 21. 21 is going to be a year that it's going to break out for everybody. Boxing, life, new agendas, good agendas, hopefully, and big things. And I think that's, that's, how I'm, that's, how I'm, that's what my mindset is with 21. And what way to take January 2nd, the top of the year, which is rarely done. You know that. And have a, a, a fight of this magnitude to kick off the first of the year. I mean, we ain't got to wait and, and get past the winter and next, you know, you got January, you got February. So you got February, March. Then you're getting ready for his new, uh, May, you know, Secret de Mayo. No, we're coming out of the gate trying to – Ryan is coming out of the gate the first of the year, right after New Year's. And saying, give me Luke Campbell and watch what I do to him. And, and, and let me tell you, man, I won't be surprised if you get him out of there late between nine and 12 rounds. But it's going to go some rounds. It's definitely going to go some rounds. I'll be shocked if it don't. Hmm. And, and on, either, on either side. On either side. Not just one. On either side. <laughs> you can't just, you know, Luke ain't a He's not coming in as an opponent. 
That's not, he can't help himself. That's not his makeup, never been. 